Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Siege! Today we'll be doing another scenario playing as the Children of Light against the forces of darkness. This time I'm going to do Castle Alyssa 938B. Let's begin. And I will be playing as the Defender this time. Gonna stick with average difficulty. In this game, as you can tell, the forces of darkness have already begun the siege. They've put down a siege tower, they have some ladders, and they have quite a bit of troops in our castle already. Let's take a look at and see what what kind of enemy types they have. So they have these troll warriors who are giants and great attackers. They also have troll sergeants who are the same as troll warriors but with slightly better attack and defense. And over here they have their Tekir elite archers. These guys are gonna be trouble for us. And we got more orc warriors over here, more orc warriors. And here's our defenses. So we have on our side, we have the elf archers. These guys are going to be a lot better than the human archers that we saw in the last episode. But they are not nearly as good as these Takir elite archers. All right, so let's get organized here. We have a lot going on, including this group here protecting the gate. I don't need them. So I'm going to go ahead and have these guys uh, try to get down here. And what do we got here? Some more guys. We're just going to send these guys out to start attacking. want to try to drive the enemy out of our castle. And I'm just going to send more troops to attack. And I'm sending this group to just defend. And over here is our human berserkers. These troops are particularly good at attack. They are not as good at, on the defense. So they're similar to the human warrior, but they have better attack but less defense. And I'm just, I am going to have them just defend the uh, town square here. And what do we have over here? More human warriors, but this time we have an elemental of plant. These guys are a little bit stronger than the human warriors. And I think I got another ballista. Okay, so these are catapults that have boiling oil. So they will get an extra attack bonus and it also does an airy attack. So this one I want to be cautious about where they're attacking. Let's just go in this general area over here. And I'm going to go ahead and set the speed to the very slowest because things are going to happen really fast. So let's go ahead and unpause it and see what happens. Okay, so here they come. We have engaged in combat. We've got our berserkers taking on their troll warriors. I think I need to get some archer backup, so let's get 21 archers. So we have some more advanced troop types here. Um, we have the blue wizard. Blue wizards are very powerful, they do an area attack, but when they die, they explode and kill a lot of friendly fire, so you kind of want to have them be alone. And we have our dwarf hero, he's really powerful. We don't want to waste him, we want to save him for when necessary. I'm just going to get another 21 archers. And they came he over here is where our barracks is. And I'm just going to have them attack over here from this center. Alright. Let's go. Unpause it. See what happens. 
So we've already lost quite a bit of Berserkers because they don't have good defense. Hopefully our archers can help turn the tide over here. Let's see what else is going on. So they got a lot of reinforcements coming on this direction. And what are these guys doing? Okay, they're just standing around. So I want to make sure they defend these archers over here. So let's just go have them go up. And how are we doing over here? What are these guys doing? I'm just going to make sure we defend our flag over here. And um, let's see what else we got. I want to. I'm worried about these archers being exposed. Um, I wonder if these guys can go ahead and defend these archers right here. And we can unpause it and let the action go on. Continue. The troll warriors are just demolishing our human uh, footmen. But our elven, elven archers are going to help even the odds a little bit. And we've got some human sergeants here holding the line. Let's go ahead and get another unit. we got plenty of human warriors, so I'm going to go ahead and deploy this group and get them attacking in this area here. And I want to protect these archers as best as I can. I don't want them getting through. Because it looks like my human warriors are about to get overrun. Alright, these guys, I am going to have them step back a little bit. Let's go ahead and have them attack this area from over behind this these walls. Let's see if they follow those orders. Good. I think that's far enough. Let's have them attack like this. I need the archer support. That's what's going to turn the tide of this battle. The elven archers are the best archers in the game. What is that? Do I have another catapult that's launching in my own castle? Or is that the enemy cat catapults? Okay, they're coming up with their engineers are setting ladders to cross the rivers. They've got a ballista. Here's their orc engineers with ballista. And here's my catapult missile. Let's see what that does. I want to destroy their uh, siege towers. So that's good. And here's their elite archers. I need to take these guys out, but I can't really get to them. Huh, I wonder if I can sneak these guys in here. Let's go ahead and just uh, see if I can do that with this berserker squad. Go, 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 guys, go! Let's get them through. And I gotta keep looking at this battle over here. Okay, I think it's going good. Get those elite archers! Yes. Get them. Okay. They've got backup. But we're already doing a number on these archers. This is kind of a suicide squad anyways. These are berserkers. They're surrounded. How's this battle going with all these uh, trolls and troll sergeants? I think it's getting under control. Let's take a look at their health bar. Uh, yeah, a lot of them are damaged, so... Those, our elven archers are doing their job, and our humans are holding the line. Good, they're retreating. Okay, let's see if I can get these guys to report back to the barracks. Let their... If anybody can survive our, from our suicide squad, I think they're just going to fight. Maybe if I send them down here, they will get out of the way. And maybe some of them will survive. Alright, looks like we're mopping up over here. That's good. Okay, return to barracks. These four guys that are survivors. We've got a couple of sergeant. They'll be in the hospital for sure. Alright. What are these catapults? Wow, look at that. We have just... Oh, that was the, I think, damage from the archers. That was what's left of this unit. Um, What's over here? Okay, these guys are... 
I don't think I give them orders, so I want to make sure that they're not firing any, f doing any friendly fire. Let's go ahead and zoom back in. Looks like things are going pretty well for us on this first day. Yeah, be careful of this friendly fire over here. Oh, we completely destroyed their siege tower. They still have ladders. So, night falls. Let's see. We lost 23 sergeants, 15 berserkers, and 56 human warriors with a 1 to 1 casualty rate. I think that's pretty good. I think we might actually outnumber them in this scenario. So that was a pretty good day for us considering they had all those elite troll warriors. And we should be demolishing this group of orcs soon enough. What do they got over here? They're probably planning some sort of attack on the gates. I'm going to have these guys return to barracks. I like to have my catapults using oil so that they can do more devastating attack. I'm going to keep an eye on these guys, what they're doing. Are they just returning to base? Yeah, I think so. Alright, these guys will be dead soon. Let's take a look at our guys. These guys are pretty wounded. But let's just finish these out. These orcs off real quick. I am going to have them return to barracks. You too. We've got this force, which I think is pretty good health. They can handle these stragglers. Oh no, I got our engineers fighting these orcs. Come on, guys. Don't entangle with them. Alright, they're destroyed. Let's go ahead and see what's going on here. They got a ballista over here. They still have some ladders. They got another siege tower over here with our damaged walls. They should be able to cross that. And let's see. They're got some wounded guys. Let's have them return to barracks. Let's get a small elite force. Let's go ahead and do ten berserkers. We're gonna send them after these guys out here. And I'm gonna get another bigger force. Deploy them to well, the wait for that elite force. I'm just going to have him defend this general area. We're going to defend the towers. Where's my berserker squad? There they go. What do we got over here? We've got skeleton warriors and a Zorlim, which is a magician. We have undead longsword shields only. Skeleton warriors. Not too big of a threat. And what do we have over here? These are their elite archers again. Uh, I don't see... Oh, they are trying to put ladders up here. Let's uh, redirect this group here to defend over here. And I'm going to get some 25 to just attack this general area from over here. Go. So here's their second wave. They're going to put ladders up and they're supporting it with their missile attack. But we'll get them with our missiles. Let's go ahead and just have them start firing as soon as possible. Go. This group is going to probably get pretty devastated with this their elite archer attack. Yeah, we already lost a guy here. Come on, get firing. Fire back. I'm going to get another set of five engineers. Actually, I'm going to do ten engineers with a single catapult and some boiling oil. Deploy that. Have them attack this general area from just over here. And you guys just attack this group. Let's see how that goes. Go! Get those engineers. So regular human warriors can't actually destroy ballista or siege equipment, but we can kill engineers. And they need five engineers to operate a ballista or a catapult. So if we kill these other four guys, they, that ballista is now useless. Okay. Uh, where did our archers go? They just got obliterated by these... To cure elite archers. 
Should I send out my blue wizard? No, he's going to be... I don't want my blues, blue wizard being hit by um, their archers. So let's just keep sending our, uh, our elven archers after their guys. I'm going to get another guy. I'm going to get a ballista to target this group as well. And they do have their ladders in place. Uh, let's just send him over here. Hurry up. And maybe I can send him out of the gates and have him start attacking those archers before those orc warriors get here. Yeah, go, go, go. Get those archers. Man, those uh, elite archers are devastating for us. Okay, I'm going to have these guys return to barracks before these... Well, looks like it's too late. But they did their job. They took out that ballista. And now they're kind of just stuck. Alright, here comes their skeleton warriors. So I need um, some guys to take those guys out. Let's just get some regular human warriors and get them on the move over here and we'll get them some archer support as well just 15 and well, where should we deploy these guys just over here I think I don't know if that's going to be safe for them oh uh, why are these guys going this way we'll have them hit these uh, archers in the back All right, um, we did our job of destroying these ladders. That was uh, useful. And now these guys are returning to barracks. We're in a full-on archer battle. These guys are wounded. Maybe this time we can take them out. Ooh, they just got hit by a ballista. I mean, by a catapult. That was really good. Nice. Okay, they got their skeletons in our base. Uh, let's get some more. We'll send another large force. Okay, that's all we have available. But we'll send them out here to just attack this general area. Because they're coming straight for our flag with their skeleton warriors. And where's our guys? Here they come. And we got our berserkers protecting our our flag, but we've also got this this other backup support unit. I want to keep these guys protecting this group of archers. And what do we got over here? Um, so these guys are not firing at all. I wonder if I could get them to fire on these guys. I don't know if they can fire over those buildings. Yeah, we can. We can fire over those buildings. I don't know how much damage arrows do against skeletons. Because in a lot of games, skeletons have immunity to arrows. But I don't think that's the case in this game. Alright, got to keep an eye on things. This battle's going pretty well. Let's get these guys. These guys have been the heroes of this game so far. Uh, but I'm going to send them out. They, we've got their troll warriors who are really tough. And, um, you know, I'm more concerned with the troll warriors than Alright, let's see, these guys are, their troll warriors are all full health. My, uh, berserkers are getting crushed by them. Okay, night falls. So we lost 37 Elven archers. That hurts. Seven sergeants, nine berserkers, and 29 human warriors. Still one to one. I think that's going pretty good. Uh, we got 10 guys out of the hospital. Let's take a look at the overview battle. Okay. We are taking care of these uh, skeletons pretty well, I think. So I think that's going to is under control. 
and this is probably under control. These guys uh, are getting pretty wounded. I actually, these guys are doing pretty good. They've lost a lot of their squad, but these guys here are actually doing doing pretty good. So we'll have them keep fighting. Let's see what we got in the barracks. We can send another group of 15 archers, I think, somewhere. Um, let's go ahead. What's going on up here? Oh, that's their archers. So let's have an archer duel over here. Oh, we just hit a bullet. I mean, a catapult bomb over here. Alright, our archers are now firing at them and they are retreating. Good. Alright, let's get them to focus on this group. Like that. Alright. Skeletons taken care of. We got these troll roys. Okay, our guys are retreating. Wonder if we can order them back into the fight. Let's go ahead and get another squad out here pronto. More elite troops. Get them deployed. Go. Protect our archers. Okay, good. These guys are staying in the fight. Ooh, they got their flags. They are tr gonna try to plant their flag. I think it's a little too soon. We kinda got this under control. We got their their guys under control here. We got our archer support. Gonna help out. I don't know what these engineers are planning because they're not gonna make it through. Alright, their skeleton warriors are retreating. We're gonna take out this group of engineers. Let's do a targeted attack. There we go. Take out those engineers. Uh-oh. Troll Warriors got through, but our backup support arrived just in time. Alright, you guys attack from here, and I think this... Where's my other archers? Right here. So, just attack from where you currently are. Just wanted to make sure they're attacking this guy. Oh, what's going on? I hate it when they just walk right through my troops get to my archers. Yeah. How's these guys' health? Pretty good. Okay. Man, their orc engineers are actually kind of tough. I think they're a lot tougher than our engineers. Yeah, get out of there. Get out of there. Return to barracks. Come on, Elven Archers, don't just die from there like this. Okay, they, they escaped. What's their health like? Uh, let them go back. I'm going to get another group of Elven Archers to support this attack. And you go here. Actually, I need to get... I need to get these guys back. And... We're going to stand a little bit further back. Like, you just stay where you are. Right there. And I need another group of uh, human warriors to lead this attack. Because these guys are... There's, there's not many of these guys, so... Just get them going there. Hey, they're troll warriors. Okay, they change in tactics. We've got them surrounded. Nice. We're firing missiles at them. Man, it's taking forever for us to get these new orc engineers. Okay, that's going good. Here comes our reinforcements. These guys are firing good. They're to their range. Okay, how's the health of this unit? Okay, I'm going to have them keep fighting because they're actually pretty healthy. They're fatigued, but they're healthy. So, keep them in the fight at this point. 
Same with this guy. We gotta move him forward. This sergeant is wounded. Let's have him return to barracks. Good. Their trolls are troll warriors are retreating. Let's see what else. Okay, are they planning something up here? They just got their archers up here. Um, can I reach them from here? Maybe. Let's see. Yeah, good. I've got better range, I think, than their elite archers. So here they come, raining down the arrows. Watch their health drop. Good. Okay, I gotta keep an eye on the battle down here. Another night falls. All right, let's see, one to one again. Looks like they're starting something else, or no, that's their guys retreating. Okay, they are bringing out more ladders and archers to support them. And they are, my elven archers have better range, and so they are doing a lot of damage. Okay, they're getting their ladders up. I better get some guys here to defend this area. Uh, let's just do 10. I don't want to waste all my berserkers. So we'll get them to defend this area. They got their ladder, so they'll probably send some support, infantry support. I don't know what those guys are doing. Oh, my elven archers. They did finally attack them. Interesting. I guess they were in range this whole time. Uh, let's go ahead. Attack. From right over here. Let's see if I can get this group to attack them. they're bringing out more bridges. They need to be sending troops to support this, but they're not. What's, what's over here? Skeletons? If I order them out here, will they... Can they move out? No, it's just the front guys attacking right now. We're doing good damage. And they're sending our their archers right into us. Interesting. I'm trying to put more ladders up. My guys will probably destroy their ladders. Alright, we're just gonna keep pressing forward with this attack. And, uh, yeah, we're taking out their archers. They got ladders, but they won't be able to place them. I'm surprised they don't have any kind of infantry backup. What are these skeletons doing over here, too? Maybe I should deal, send out, uh, kind of an elite squad here to take out these skeletons and this magician. Let's go. Uh,. They do have one ladder to get out. Actually, I'm kind of worried about this group. If I go here, they have no way of getting back in. So I'm not going to do that. I'm going to have them just return to barracks. Because they'll break the ladder and then they won't be able to get back in. Well, they could get back in through this uh, siege tower, I think. Let's, but let's not use my best guys. Let's just go ahead. How are these guys doing? 
Okay, these guys have pretty good health. Let's go have them take out these skeletons. guy is probably going to be one of their strongest, stronger units. Alright, we lost a few guys, but still one to one, so I think we've got the upper hands. And those guys are returning to barracks, so we're going to do the same. care of their elite archers. I think I'm going to have this group return to barracks because they are pretty wounded. But I'm not sure if they can do that. I don't know if they have any way back in. They're kind of stuck out here. They can go... I think they could go this way if they can fight their way through and then cut, go around. I'm gonna go ahead and speed things up a little bit. I'm gonna go to medium. I think the enemy is pretty exhausted at this point. I think we've, uh, see if I can return them to barracks. They're smart enough to know a way back. Okay, we've got some orc sergeants. I mean, orc engineers that we have to take care of first. Oh, they did. They planted their ladders. Okay, they are sending out another force, so that's good. Oh, I want this guy, these guys to return to barracks. Alright, they do have some guys left, so this battle's not quite over yet. These guys are okay. Uh, we'll return to barracks. We'll get some more squads out. We'll see where this group's going. This group is going down here. So I'm going to get... And... Get them to attack here. And just so that you get to see it, I am going to send my blue wizard out. So you can see his devastating attack. And But I have to be careful and not do friendly fire. So there's no archers out here, so he's not going to be vulnerable. I mean, unless he gets up close. Let's go ahead and see him. Get through those guys. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, there they are. So I'm going to have him attack, but make sure to attack the backs, and just right where you're at. Okay, go ahead, attack. Use your fireball. It's going to be devastating. Okay, we lost a sergeant. Uh, uh-oh. Yeah! Got him right in there. Okay, good. Uh, let's see. Attack this area from right here. You gotta kinda control these wizards. Their attacks are devastating, and then they also to friendly fires. So. <laughs> okay. Let's see if they're bringing anybody else. Okay, they are. So let's go ahead and have them attack here. From right where you're standing. See how he does on these skeletons. Boom! Boom! He's just devastating those guys. They are making their way in. So I'm gonna get another group to defend my flag over here. Make sure they don't get in. 
Let's get some archer support besides my blue wizard. There, okay, he can attack right here. Good. Look at that. Look at that attack. I gotta make sure that he is protected. I gotta protect him. He is really powerful and doing massive damage. Yeah, blue wizards are amazing. Uh, we got, what do we got here? We got some, some guys trying to attack us from over here. Let's just keep this group here. And keep him attacking this group of orcs. Get our archers fired on these skeletons. We're defending. I think we're going to have a much better ratio today because of the blue wizard. Yeah, six to one. Ten guys out of the hospital. Good. Look at these guys, they're just burning up. It's just so cool. Okay, I think we got those orcs taken care of. We'll have our blue wizard go after these skeletons. And you'll stay right where you're at. And start firing at these skeletons. Why isn't he firing? I don't know why he's not firing. Oh no, he's being attacked! Oh no! Oh no! No, if he dies, all these archers are gonna die. Attack! Get him! Oh no! Okay, good. How's his health doing? Okay, he's actually got some good health but he was in melee combat. That's why he wasn't firing. Okay, I gotta get these archers back. Yeah, you gotta really watch out your blue wizards. They're very powerful, and they do a lot of damage, but when they explode, they ex when they die, they explode and will kill everybody near them in just a massive, fiery death. All right, here we go. Wipe out these skeletons. Oh, they're bringing more skeletons. Just gonna defend with our humans and hit him with our missiles. It's gonna be the best strategy for this. Check out their health. They're trying more flags, but it's not gonna work for them. I need to get another group of humans to defend this uh, tower. Not many left, I mean, not many available, so just, I guess, attack or defend. I don't know really what the difference between defend and attack is. Oh, 8 to 1 today, nice. What's our blue wizard doing? Okay, go ahead and attack this area from right where you're at. No, because they're running away. Uh-oh! What happened here when I wasn't looking? They went in and got my archers from behind. Have these guys all return to barracks. And turn these guys around. Ah, oh, they did a little sneak attack. Alright, I really can't do much. I can send out my Dwarven hero and with some elementals. Send out an elite squad to take this guy group on. Uh, I think that's what I'll try to do. Let's go! Keep 
an eye on him. See if this group can take on some bunch of orcs. Oh, but I don't want him to get hit by the friendly fire. Uh oh. Let's have him return to barracks. Uh, okay, they just must have wiped out a bunch of my guys because. Oh no, we we had guys return to the barracks. So, okay, finally got a decent sized group to take on this. And hopefully our Dwarven hero can survive and get in the hospital. What else they got? Okay, this is under control. There's three guys there. They're sending it's just engineers. So it's just this group here. And I think we can handle them with our larger unit. Okay, they're fleeing. And so we're going to go ahead and defend this area. Okay, what do you got coming our way? I think it's just those engineers. Are they they're retreating or are they Okay, they're attacking. Let's get some archer support. Mm, not many. Not many archers. But we can find some maybe here in the quad. Yeah, get them to support. Get them over there and we'll send our blue wizard here as well. Make sure he doesn't attack inside the gates. Like that. Get him over here. Keep an eye on him too. I think my humans are about to retreat. Nice. Uh, let's see, do I have any... I could send just a bunch of berserkers out by themselves. Oh, they're coming this way too. Uh, these guys are fine. We can help out. Well, we don't even need them. Do I have any more archers? We'll just keep them here. I think we can handle them by ourselves. Uh, let's get our blue wizard fighting this group over here. They out of range, blue wizard? I think so. Let's get him closer. We did lose a plant elemental, but we're getting much better casualty rates. All right, our berserkers are out there, berserking. Let's have them return to barracks. You guys are holding the line while my blue wizard is unleashing devastating attacks. My archers are unleashing devastating attacks. Ah! They got some elite archers here. Let's target them. Can I target with archers? Yeah, I can. There we go. Let's just target that group. Good. Uh-oh, what happened? What happened? Return to barracks. Why'd you guys retreat? You're pretty healthy. Uh, let's see if I can get another group to, out here. We need a pretty strong group. There, that should do it. Get you guys up here. Get back. Ooh, my blue wizard, my blue wizard. Gotta make sure they're not targeting my blue wizard. As soon as this group comes in line, I'm gonna have this group retreat. As soon as they step up, good. I have this group return to barracks. And 
Can I get some more guys to defend them? Yes, I can. And we're going to deploy, have them go up here as well. How's my blue wizard doing? Still firing? Yep. Just love it when their fireballs explode right in the middle of a group of enemies. Uh, their elite archers are doing some massive damage. Let's get some more of our archers. Target them. Alright, I think it'll be safe to go over here. These orcs are retreating. Good. We're targeting their elite archers. I'm not sending my guys out. We're just going to have them in this general area while archers attack. Okay, that group of skeletons is fried. Let's get... I, I don't want them anywhere near this tier elite archers. Well, we lost quite a few more guys today, but and we're back to one to one. But I think the enemy is getting pretty close to being exhausted. Maybe, not sure. Okay, we got those guys. Let's just have our lead archers, our elven archers, attack. Should make short work of these orcs. They're just regular orcs. Let's see, keep an eye on the battle. They're coming back down here. Let's get our. I think our blue wizard will just attack automatically when as soon as they come, and we've got them well defended. Miss with that shot, but he'll start hitting them. There we go. There we go. Got that troll. Getting those orcs. Nice. Oh, here they come again. Let's make sure we keep an eye on this. These guys are probably pretty fatigued. So let's get another group of reinforcements. And have them just defend this tower. And then when they get here, I'll send this group back. Get here. Send this group back to report to barracks to heal up. And how's this group doing? They're probably pretty tired too. Do I have anybody else? No. Uh, how about them? They're doing okay. And I've had this group here for a long time. They're protecting this archers, but maybe that's better to defend this tower. And who is more wounded? I don't know. Maybe this group. So maybe I'll send this group back. But not right yet. Okay. Okay, we'll have this group go back. Alright, not many guys lost today. And we did a what, massive damage to the enemy. 16 to 1. Four guys out of the hospital. Ooh! Ooh, what do we got here? We've got the Dread Knight. These is their equivalent to our Dwarven hero. He, they're very powerful. Um, let's get more guys out here to deal with them. Uh, I could send out my Dwarven hero, but I kind of don't want to waste him just yet. And make sure this doing okay here this group is fresh this group is pretty fresh they got we got some fatigue but we're actually pretty fresh so oh where'd their dread knights go did our blue wizard get them no he's sending them out somewhere else we're getting them back to the barracks weird why would they do that They got their engineers leading the assault for whatever reason. 
It's uh, actually probably the safest place for them with considering our blue wizards blasting the, the back of their formation. What do we got here? More skeletons. I don't I don't know why they retreated with the their trolls in that dread knight. They should have pressed forward with those guys. But we kinda got this situation really well under control here. Here comes another large attack force. Lead, led by their engineers. And they're again they're gonna attack this tower. And again our blue wizard's gonna just smash him. Two guys, 25 to 1. Another successful day. So these sieges can last up to 90 days, but once the enemy runs out of engineer units, or runs out of units to attack, the siege will end automatically. So if they keep sending their engineers up, and if we kill all their engineers... Ah, here's an elite group. Uh, we need to send something out to back up our guys. Let's go ahead and do that, and then just defend this area. How are these guys doing? They're doing fine. We've got our elite... Oh, there's their Dread Knights. Right there. Again, they, they don't seem to want to risk their Dread Knights. Oh, they were pretty low on health. That's why. Yeah, they don't want to risk those guys. So as soon as those Dread Knights got low on health, they sent them back to retreat. Yeah, and these orcs, they're, they're not going to do anything because we're just really well defended and we got our archer support. You know, I think we took out most of their archers so they can't uh, do a proper attack. We're going to have an advantage on everything we do. Because we've got our blue wizard and we've got our elite elves. Or not elite elves, but regular elves, archers. There are elite elf, elven archers in this game. But not in this scenario. And here comes more engineers. We kill these guys. They may call off the siege. set it to the fastest speed. And with that, we have triumphed. Your troops cheer upon the walls as the enemy files away. You have saved Castle Alyssa. And with that, this siege, we are victorious. We had a lot of guys left over, a lot of human warriors. Uh, we were pretty low on archers. We lost most of them. Let's take a look at our hospital. So we had a few guys left in the hospital, but with that, we're victorious, and this is going to end this episode. Thank you for watching. Bye.